Hello and welcome to this video showing you all the field guide page locations in the Highlands in Hogwarts Legacy. If you have any questions, comment below and I will help you out. Now let's get started. Let's start at the North Ford Bog area. Go ahead and teleport to Pit Upon Ford. Then you can hop on your broom and go straight across. When you come to this sign, you know you're in the right place. You can use Revelio to get your page. Now let's go ahead and teleport to the East North Ford Bog. From here, you can exit the house and then hop on your broom. And you want to go in this direction towards all these trees and the bones. And then you want to curve around to the side here. And that little light there is where we're going to land. And right we're here better. is our next page. Now we're going to go to Hogsmeade Valley, so you can go ahead and teleport to Hogsmeade. And here I am at the entrance of Hogsmeade, and I'm going Sometimes towards the garden area. Down. You want to make your way straight through the garden and up these stairs. And then you'll come to this bench where you'll find the next page. Now I'm going to jump off the balcony here because we need to get into the fly zone. So just keep running out until you can hop on that broom. Then just take off following the railroad track and keep going straight. Once you see that little house, start aiming for it because the next page is going to be right in front of this house. And there you have it. Now you can hop on your broom again and we're going to the fortress in the back here. There will be enemies in this area, so just be careful as you fly around. You want to make your way to the back left corner of this fortress, and the next page will be in front of this table. Now you can teleport to Upper Hogsfield. Once there, you can hop on your broom and then head over here towards this building. And once you see the barrels, go into the room next to it, and you'll find the next page. Revelio. Now let's go to the North Hogwarts region by teleporting to the Forbidden Forest, Flu Flame, and then you can hop on your broom and go straight towards the cliffside here. And when you see the second smaller cliff, go towards that and you'll find a bench with the next page. Rebellia. Now from here, we can get on our broom and go towards the South Hogwarts region to get to the next page, and we are aiming for the Hogsmeade train station. Okay, here's the station, and we want to go ahead and land right in front of this building that says Hogsmeade Station, and you will find the next page. Now we can teleport to Erinshire and then run straight forwards to this broken cage. Right in front of it will be our next page. From here, you can hop on your broom and then make your way straight across the lake. Once you spot the little house, make your way towards it because that is our destination. Then you can land in front of the house, go inside, and right here is the field guide page. Now we are going to the Hogwarts Valley area by teleporting to Lower Hogsfield. From here, hop on your broom and then fly down and you want to follow this dirt path through the forest. When it splits, you want to go towards the right. And then it'll split again, you'll go to the right again and you'll come to this small encampment where you will find the next page. From here, you can hop on your broom and go in this direction. And when you see the river, you know you're getting close and you want to make your way towards the left where this big rock is with all these small rocks stacked on top of each other. And there's the next page. Now we can go ahead and teleport to Brockboro. Once there, we can hop on our brooms and then go over here towards this little garden. And right next to the scarecrow is our next page. Revelio. Next, let's go ahead and teleport over here to Keenbridge. And directly left of the Flu Flame will be our next page. 
Then you can hop on your broom and go down here towards the beehives to get the next page. And I'm gonna hop on my broom again and go towards this little house with a tree growing through it. Here we can reveal the next page. Now hop on your broom and you're going to want to make your way up the hillside here. You can follow the dirt pass slightly. You will come to a small gravestone where we can find the next page. Now we can hop on our broom and we want to go straight up to this hillside here. And we are going to a bandit camp. And then over here, you will find a camp. There will be a bunch of enemies here. You can try to stealth through or fight through if you want. I already killed them earlier, so that's why no one's here for me. And right over here will be the next page. Now we can teleport to the Northern South Sea Bog location, which will take us to the South Sea Bog area. From there, you can exit this house and hop on your broom. And you want to go in towards the bog, past all these trees, and when you see a broken down little house over here, and you can use Revelio to get the next page. Now our next destination is the Feldcroft region. First we will teleport to Irondale. Once there you can hop on your broom and fly to the right there will be a windmill with a page in front of it. Revelio. From here you will want to hop on your broom and head this way towards the ocean. And we're going to be flying for quite a while here. Once you see that wooden structure there, you know you're in the right place. You want to make your way below because hidden underneath this cliffside is a mining area. And you want to go straight to the forge over here to get the next page. You can't collect pages while in combat though, so let me get rid of these guys real quick. Alright, we got the page. Now let's go ahead and teleport to Feldcroft. Here, go straight forwards to the well and use Revelio to get the next page. Then hop on your broom and go back here towards the target dummies to find another page. Now we want to fly over this way. past the bandit camp and towards that dead looking tree here, but we stop at the cliff right before the tree, turn around and you'll find the next page. Now I'm gonna hop on my broom and head back to Feldcroft. You can teleport if you want to, but I think this is faster. And in the distance there past Feldcroft, you will see a tower. That is where we are heading. Once you get to the tower, there is an area on the left side here you can land on, and this is where we will find another page. Now we can go ahead and teleport to West Hogwarts Valley. Once there, hop on your broom and just go straight up because we are going to the top of the cliff that is to our right. Then you can move forwards towards this ruin area and right in front of the rock will be another page. Now it is time to go to the coastal cavern area, which can be tricky to go to. The easy way to get this page is to teleport to the North Point Seer Coast flame and then right next to it will be the page. But just in case you do not have that teleport yet, I'm going to show you how to get there because it can be kind of tricky. You can't just follow the path on the map. There's actually a tunnel you have to go through. So this is where I am on the map right now. And you will want to come to this bandit camp here and towards the back area against the cliff wall you will find the entrance to the tunnel. Now there will be a bunch of enemies here that might be high level for you. You can stealth past all of them, taking it slow. I'm just going to fight all of them because they'll make it faster for me to get through here. But all you have to do is just follow this tunnel straight up to get to that flu flame location. And there is an additional flu flame location on my left here that you can also go ahead and grab if you want it. But I'll let you follow me through this cave. 
Okay, now when you get here, this is near the exit of the tunnel, and we can come out here, and there's the flu flame I was talking about earlier. And right here, where like the guardrail is all broken up, you can find the next page. Now we can go to the Cragcroft Flu Flame location, and this will be in the Cragcroft Shire area of the map. Once there, you can exit the house, and you want to make your way to the tree that is in the very center of this little village, and that is where you will find the next page. Revelio. From here, hop on your broom, and you want to go over here. This is going to lead us to a beach. Once you see that giant skeleton on the beach, make your way towards it, because that is where the next page location is. Now let's fly into the Klagmar Coast region of the area, and we are going to fly straight towards that encampment over here. Stay to the left side of the encampment and then land right here to get the next page. Then hop on your broom and we're going to go straight down from the fortress where you see all these paths. And where that broken, busted up looking tent area is, is where the next page is going to be. And there are the locations of all 31 field guide pages in the Highlands. I hope this has helped you out and thanks for watching.